where did the idea uh, for Hobo with a Shotgun come up? Because for most people, they saw it as a, one of the fake trailers mm -hmm. for the Tarantino Rodriguez Grindhouse stuff. Well, the original idea for the movie uh, came about because we were, me and John Davies, who's my best friend, he's the writer of the film, we were hanging out the, at this pizza joint back home called Ronnie's Pizza. It's where we go to pitch ideas for films. And at the time, my buddy Mojo tagged along, and he had really long hair. Actual name Mojo? Yeah, that's his name, Mojo. Awesome. <laughs> and uh, he, had, he had a scruffy shirt, and he just bought this airsoft shotgun that shoots plastic pellets and me and John are just pitching ideas back and forth and Mojo speaks up and says well, why don't you guys make a movie about me and John kind of looks over and looks him up and down and says what a, a hobo with a shotgun <laughs> and it was like a light bulb went off we we're like whoa so the day we heard about that contest we went out and we started shooting that very night. We didn't use any of the footage, but it just got the ball rolling because yeah. we only had five. We had two weeks to shoot it, cut it, and then get it sent in. And uh, we submitted it, and uh, to our surprise, it ended up winning that contest. That's, gotta be, that's a crazy moment. Because oh, wasn't man, yeah. Rodriguez's book influential in your life? Absolutely. Like, when I was in college, um, there was a moment where I didn't know, like, if I wanted to continue with making films. I was going through a hard time, and I read his book, and he made his first feature film with $5,000, and he just basically preached uh, to filmmakers to learn every aspect of the film industry. And so once I read that book, I just took it upon myself to learn everything. I learned how to grip and gaff, how to light, how to uh, shoot, how to sound mix. And so I just I took it as an opportunity just to learn every aspect of it. So when I got out of school, I could... I didn't have to necessarily necessarily rely on a bunch of other people to do all these jobs. I could do them myself. What's, did you meet him? What's, what was that like? It was really cool. I was. Uh, it was interesting because uh, at South by Southwest, they played this reel that showed me sitting on the panel with him at that grindhouse competition, and uh, I had never seen the footage uh, from it before, and I just looked like a nervous wreck. I was such a <laughs> fanboy. <laughs>